From South Korea to growing up in Yorktown, Marshfield, Tia Burtz was adopted at just 17 months. These days, she's making a big name for herself in the manufacturing world. And Tia is here to tell you that seeing is truly believing. Dale Ryman has this story. Tia's a rock star in, in the 3D printing world. Tia Burtz is a recent graduate of North Central Technical College. She interned at Hostrider Industries in Marshfield. Tia is somebody that uh, we've known for a few years and uh, have seen her develop her interest into manufacturing 3D printing. In a field where precise measurements down to the thousandths of an inch is key. I was diagnosed of optic nerve hypoplasia. Tia is legally blind. The measurement on that is hard to read of my normal vision. She can only see clearly a couple of inches in front of her. And I can kind of see something. But she's always visualized things in a 3D world. At a tech show in Chicago, Tia stumbled across a booth with a virtual reality headset. I was in this virtual environment and I got this part assembled and the person running the demo was just blown away. We didn't really know how we could fit her into a manufacturing facility with her limited sight. With the help of some government grants, Tia was fitted for VR goggles with a tiny camera on it. I can actually see the tool in the machine. That gives her 20-20 vision. We got to see Tia for the first time reading something on the wall across the room. Once I figured out what I could do, I was just blown away, surprised, and really excited. Tia might be the first to use virtual reality in the world of manufacturing, but she doesn't want to be the only one. I want to be an advocate for visually impaired people and tell them that manufacturing is a possibility for them to go into with the right technology. In your town, Marshfield, Dale Ryman, News Channel 7.